the year 2019 was the second warmest year on record since 2016 and you are the reason for the change in weather. Yes, you. What? Me? How can I affect the climate? According to a study, every individual produces approximately 0.7 kg of CO2 per day. Only half of which can be absorbed by the vegetation and the sea. The rest stay in the environment and blocks the sun ray, which results in global warming. It may increase the existing 1.1 degrees Celsius of average surface temperature. So what? Just one degree more. I'll stay at home and the air condition will be just more than enough. It means summer will be warmer, which gonna evaporate more water from the ground, and which gonna return in heavy rains that will bring flood. Increase in temperature will also melt the ice caps, which gonna rise the sea level, which will bring strong storms and floods in the coastal region. As air contains moisture, snowfall will increase and winter will be colder too. In 2016, 125 nations signed the Paris Climate Change Agreement to reduce carbon emissions. But the result didn't came. Even US stepped out of the agreement. Change in climate has taken notice all around the world, and over 7 million people came out of their home protesting and demanding action from the government. So, what else we can do? We have cut down more than half of the trees of the world for our basic needs. We need to bring this land back to their natural state. We need to restore this ecosystem we have already cut down. 76% of CO2 produced by burning fossil fuels. So electrification of all sector who runs on fossil fuels will help a lot and applying advanced negative emission tech which captures CO2 produced by factories and store them into a long term geological storage facility and switching into more renewable energies like solar plants and wind turbines. Guys if you like it subscribe to my channel for more videos and let me know in the comment section that it was informatic or not or it's just okay okay and once again thanks for watching.